Hi guys, see it's Tuesday today, and you're watching The Den. Alright guys, so this week on The Den, we're doing Scavenger Hunt. And this week we've decided to switch it up a little bit. We asked you to pick out the things for us to find. And I failed miserably at it. Of the list, I think I managed to find two, maybe three items. And I'm sure I probably could have found more. Unfortunately, when you work until 10 o'clock at night, it doesn't leave much time. And unfortunately, most of the shops are closed. So there is that. We have several people who have asked us to find several things. Now, there was a few things that, not a problem, didn't have any issues finding. And a few that I thought, okay, these will be easy. Because of the time of day, the shops were closed, and because of the time of the year, the shops in Niagara Falls are only open for certain periods of time, usually like five, six hours down on Clifton Hill. So there was actually a place called Sugar Mountain that I had anticipated on going to to find Koala Carmelos for Spencer, and they have an entire section of all British import candies and nothing from Australia. So Spencer, I apologize, but I failed you miserably this week and could not find anything even remotely close to Koala Carmelos. I did look them up online, I know what they look like, and not a chance in hell. Sorry Spencer, I'll have to try harder next time I guess, or figure something out. So, let's see what we got here. So Clinton wanted an action figure from my youth. Okay, so technically it's not really an action figure. Come on. Come on, you know it. Tigra. From Thundercats. The best cartoon from when I was a kid. Or, well, maybe not the best, but definitely one of the best. Now, Adam wanted halouva, which is, I guess, a sort of Middle Eastern dish, very similar to Turkish Delight. I looked all over the place. I could not find this. And I know I've seen it in shops, but out until 11 o'clock the other night trying to find it and could not find it. So I kind of cheated. When I heard hell of a, I thought, maybe he means hell of a good dip. No, 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 I was wrong. I failed. So I apologize, Adam. So every day this week we're doing a shout out for everybody who suggested an item and I went with the easiest one. I'm sorry, Alex, but it... Yours was the easiest one to find. So this week's shout out is for Alex Pilkington. Well, not that you can really see it, but there is an American flag, Canadian, and an Ontario provincial flag. This is just inside of my room. Now, Johnny Ruin wanted a giant rainbow colored lollipop. Now, the same issue goes with the Koala Carmelos. I looked everywhere. The candy shops, I know for sure I would have had no problem finding them. But I did manage to find these. You know, these are from Crystal Beach. They're local decadent, um, natural, sweetened suckers, I guess. I've never tried them, but apparently they're really good. Let's see, I've got a problem with suckers. I don't suck. I bite. And then it kills my teeth. I have a massive, massive box of Jolly Rancher suckers that I avoid like the plague because my teeth feel like I was chewing rocks afterwards, so... Not a good thing. Too much sugar. Now, Ashley Miles wanted yellow polka dot sandals. Really? In the middle of winter? Where the hell am I supposed to find these things? And of course, yeah. I... <laughs> I am really sorry, Ashley, but I could not find yellow polka dot sandals anywhere. Uh, I don't own a pair, believe it or not. What can I say? All the stores are fresh out of their summer flip-flops and polka dot varieties, so... Uh, I failed there. Now, I did get a video of me driving past a skate park. Now, it's an indoor skate park, so it technically doesn't really... It's not really right. Um, there are lots of skate parks in Niagara. But, of course, you know, driving around late at night, filming people at parks kind of flags a little creeper. So, you know, I didn't want to do that. So, so again, Ashley, I apologize. So, the... This little footage here of the skate park is what I have. Right here, this is the indoor skating rink. Okay. Yeah. Drew, 
Drew Miller wanted the culprit, the weapon, and a place in a game of Clue. I used to have the game of Clue. I don't know what happened to it. I think it's still... My father may have it. I, I really don't know. I am failing this one miserably this week, guys. Okay, so for the last one we have Jake. And Jake wanted Plastic Army Men and the Book of Mice to Men. Now, Plastic Army Men, as I've already said, could not find. I'm sure I could have found a dollar store, but like I said, everything is closed at 10 o'clock at night. So that didn't happen. Okay, so I'm cheating at this a little bit, guys. John Steinbeck of Mice and Men. Although technically it's not the novel, it's the ebook. So does that count? I think so. A few miles south of Soldad, the Salinas River drops in close to the hillside bank and runs deep and green. The water is warm too, for it has slipped twinkling over the yellow sands in the sunlight before reaching the narrow pool. I'm sorry. I can read, but I'm terrible at reading out loud. So that's it. That's it for today, guys. Well, guys, I apologize again for this um, half-assed attempt, I guess. Uh, I've tried looking for these things, and they're just not happening. So hopefully next week will be better. Uh, next week we're doing our interview weeks with fans from the den. And I already have a fan specifically picked out. Um, it's somebody that I know in person that, that watches all my videos regularly. And, uh, yeah, so look forward to that next week, guys. All right, well, thank you for all your suggestions. Next time we do a scavenger hunt, hopefully I'll be able to actually find these things. And everything will go as planned. So that's it for today, guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful week. Stay tuned to the den. Take care. Bye for now, guys.